hello hi everyone welcome back to my channel please don't forget to like share and subscribe we are back again with the chronicles of dj zinclay and meta bongs blended family generally society is not ready for blended family people don't believe you can actually have a healthy relationship with your current partner's ex-boyfriend especially when kids are involved the thought of it sounds so bizarre it's no surprise though, because other people take advantage of the situation and get up to no good. For example, exes cheating on their currents. So we are used to seeing such toxic behavior, which makes it hard for us to believe that exes can just be genuine towards each other and have a healthy co-parenting relationship. Well, this is the case of DJ Zinclair and Medabongs. Social media, especially Twitter, goes crazy every time they see Mena Bongs, also known as Bongani, paying respect to AKA, who is actually an ex to his current wife. I remember watching DJ Zinclair's reality show on MTV, The Unexpected, when Zinclair was having a conversation with her husband, Meda about how aka the ex and the father of the firstborn wants to be part of Asante's life as well well meta bonds is or was already part of Cairo's life i guess their main point was to avoid making the kids feel left out so in that case i believe that's where they started to build a healthy blended family this is very much foreign to many people which I believe is the reason why there's so much noise on social media every time DJ Zinclay and her husband Meta Bongs and AKA's family post pictures of themselves spending time together. Honestly, I understand. Most of us have trust issues and it's understandable. When it comes to relationships, so much happens. So it's very hard to believe that exes can actually have a genuine relationship well according to my opinion some of the things i do understand especially with bongani he is showing moral support to his stepdaughter but i think dj zinclair is doing too much especially when it comes to her posting stuff like i wish heaven had visiting hours or something of some sort she's oversharing and it's really not a nice thing to be posting, honestly. I guess Bongani understands. Perhaps to him, it's more like there's really no point to cry because the guy, or AKA, is no longer around. Honestly, he's one of a kind, very special, a very understanding guy. At this point, I ask myself, what was gonna happen if the tables were turned around? As in, if it was Bongani's ex, was DJ Zinclair gonna be okay with it? Hmm, what do you guys think? Personally, I wouldn't understand that. I'm too insecure. So nope, no thanks. How about you? Would you be okay with it? Please comment down below. Otherwise, thank you guys for watching. Catch you on the next video. Bye for now.